Good, wonderful morning, and welcome back to 7 Days to Die Alpha 16.3 Build 12. Holy smokes, pimps, you are busy. And this is my 7 Days to Die Tips and Tricks um, Extravaganza to help you guys out along your way. By popular request of one person, the Danish thinker has asked me to cover farming. So, first things first, start at the beginning. To do a farm, you need a wonderful thing called a hoe. See what we need to make a hoe? We need forged iron and wood. Make sense? Let's go into the forge room. By the way, this will help you guys see around the this wrong box. You guys will get to see around the base. Well, that should be plenty of forged iron. We'll go ahead and craft that up. Well, that's crafting. Let's talk fertilizer. All right. You need to have a cement mixer, basically, to make fertilizer. And um, you're going to need rotten flesh, potassium nitrate, nitrate powder now, and dirt. We have all those ingredients. Let's look in the dirt chest. Well, we have rotten flesh there for sure. And dirt. Let's go get some more. Uh, let's see. Forge chest should have some. No. Gunpowder chest. Let's see. Yeah. That should cover it. We don't need all of that. Some of that back. And let's go to the cement mixer and get this running. Fertilizer, let's make 10 of them. Beautiful thing. It takes an extreme amount of time uh, 53 minutes to make uh, 10 fertilizer. Let's go ahead and drop our dirt off and we'll put our nitrate in there. Our hoe is complete. And let's go ahead and put our forged iron away as well. We no longer need it. As luck would have it, we'll go to our farm box. We already have fertilizer made. My advice is um, basically when you decide, okay, it's time for a farm, um, you'd probably better start making your fertilizer maybe a week in advance. So keep that in mind. Uh, prior planning on that would be great. Let's grab some wooden frames as well because we're going to need those for a build. And do we? Yeah, we should have enough time. We'll go out and start working on a little farm. Oh. Very important also, we need seeds. Let's go ahead and make some chrysanthemums and craft those up. We can get two seeds. Uh, we're going to want a little more than that. Let's see if in the farm box if we don't have more seeds. We have coffee we could make. Let's make a coffee farm. To make the coffee seeds, you will need dirt as well. All right. Craft this up. Coffee seeds. Oh, you don't need dirt. I thought you did. Maybe it's just the mushroom that you need to add dirt. Sounds like we have friends upstairs. Um, do a quick little tour of the base. That's our mine down there. We won't go in there. This is our crafting and storage room. You can see that we have everything all labeled up. Both sides of that doorway. We have electricity down here, um, two workbenches, and a chem station. This is the generator room. As you can see, nothing too exciting. That's for the lights. That's for the blade traps. Let's do a quick perimeter search. Um, via cage 848, he said to flip the spikes over. Uh, that way the Zoms can't put their heads in it. I do really like that. So that's what we have done all the way around. Excavated. We are below the surface of the earth. 
a little bit. And also we ran all of our wiring on the inside of this so you don't see the wires on the inside of your building. And yes, they do work. Go turn that on just for fun. That one's already running. Wrong one. Uh, let's turn that on. There you go. You see the lights are working. They work great all the way throughout. All right, we'll let that run. Not a big deal. I hear a screamer. And we'll also show you our gardens before we get going. This was the first little garden I made. Maybe we'll grab a couple of these chrysanthemums and. Whoops. Make a few more for our garden we're making today. 16 of them. So this was our first little garden. DT and I have been up to. Welcome to DT's farm. He said we needed a big garden. So we made a big garden. I won't take you through it all, but this is what is possible. That's all made out of reinforced concrete built in the middle of a lake. Can't walk. We have spotlights everywhere. We have a screamer screaming. What seven days to die without zombies? I mean, really. And of course, it's a rainy day in the neighborhood. This is a door that I've been building for a long time. It's basically a fall trap. What do you want? Oh, she fell off. Oh, boy. Every time I want to do tips and tricks, I get zombed. No touching. You know stunning should be the words. Die, evil beast. You lost your head. You're dead. Uh, we have a putrid girl here. Oh, we have a glowing guy. A glowing Steve spider. He dead. I recommend getting... I really am enjoying the club. Oh, we have football players running around like idiots. This is the hardest bit of these guys. The ferals are wimps, but they just run around spastically and give nothing but problems. Oh, balls, where'd you come from? Oh, with cow, I'm going to have to have a med pack here in a minute. I am using the slug, so it's pretty good. They're not exactly OP, but they're, they're doing work. Stay down. Holy cow, who hit me? A crawling football guy? Really? Ah. I've had it more of this out again, guys. This isn't what this is about. You lost your arm, bro. Holy cow. So, we'll just clean up aisle 10 here. Okay. Maybe we'll get a moment of free time here, quietness. Alright, we'll just go away from the forges so we can get some peace and quiet to do this little garden. I kind of put these uh, cement pillars out here, just basically we're very close to the trader. And uh, just to make a nice little spot to get to the trader. Alright, so basically get your hoe, get rid of those, and start tilling the ground. 
pretty easy. And you can see I'm using fertilizer as I till. Want some semblance of some shape here. Why? I don't know why that won't perk up like the rest of it has, but. It's not. There we go. Get rid of the weeds. Pick up the rock. So this is all there is to gardening. Make your seeds. Make your fertilizer. Till up some spots. And plant. Easy peasy simple. Kind of a silly thing to make a video about, but never. Really. If you don't know, you don't know. DT I think knows, but I think that he just wanted uh, everyone else to make sure they knew. <laughs> And it is a little bit awkward for planning. Alright guys, I hope this helped. I know this isn't the most beautiful garden ever. But, it's crude. It's how it's done. Um, I was going to make a nice thing out of squares. And then, you know, the zombs all distracted me. So, we'll leave it at this. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, if you have a suggestion for tips and tricks, something you want me to cover in a video, put it in the comments. I'll do it. Alright guys, till next time, this has been Like a Boss.